years ago, on July 4th, 2012, a huge breakthrough was made in particle physics. The elusive particle, called the Higgs boson, was finally discovered. It was one of the most significant achievements of the 21st century, and when it was discovered, it completed one of the most important theories in science, the Standard Model. The Higgs boson is one of the 25 elementary particles, and it has a huge job. It is responsible for giving particles their mass, and its purpose goes far beyond that. It's actually so important that it was nicknamed the God Particle. This is a picture of the particle collision that the Higgs boson was found in. The Higgs was discovered just recently, on July 4th, 2012. Now July 4th is not just United States Independence Day, but it is also Higgs boson Discovery Day. The Higgs was discovered at the Large Hadron Collider in Geneva, Switzerland, but was a large achievement for scientists all over the world. This is because the discovery of the Higgs boson made the standard model possible. This is a part of the standard model equation. All of the H's in the equation represent the Higgs boson, and without the Higgs, the equation would not work. So now you know what the Higgs boson is and why it's so important, but how does it work? The Higgs works through something called the Higgs field. The Higgs field is a field of Higgs bosons that spreads out over the entire universe. For an example, imagine that these orange dots are the Higgs bosons, and that the blue dot is a particle going through the universe. The particle goes through the universe, and the Higgs particles crowd around it, slowing its movement through the universe, and making it more massive. If you have a massless particle go through the universe, it goes through the Higgs field as if it was invisible. Since the Higgs field is not giving it mass or slowing it down, the particles go through the universe at the speed of light. There's one common misconception about the Higgs boson. The common misconception is that it gives us all of our mass, when in actuality, it gives us around 2%. The Higgs boson gives mass to the quarks, but when you add up the mass of the quarks, they only make up about 2% of the larger particle's mass. Where is that other 98% coming from? Well, unlike you see in this picture, the quarks aren't just sitting still. They are actually rapidly orbiting each other in the tiny little sphere, and it takes a ton of energy to hold them in place. The quarks have a ton of kinetic and potential energy, and based on Einstein's equation, E equals mc squared, if you have energy, you have mass. The quarks have so much energy that their energy makes up 98% of your mass. So, you might be wondering why the Higgs boson is so important if it only makes up 2% of our mass. Well, it turns out that that 2% is super important. The Higgs boson gives mass to the quarks and the electrons. And if these particles did not have mass, atoms wouldn't exist. And if atoms didn't exist, then there would be nothing but random particles floating around in the universe. Even though the Higgs boson isn't responsible for all of our mass, its contribution makes it possible for us to exist. After 50 years of being theorized, it has finally been discovered, and it has greatly simplified our view of the universe.